decorations out. So I put this welcome fall sign. I think I got this at Michael's last year. Um, I'm not sure for sure. <laughs> and then I put out this little teal pumpkin right here. I also got that at Michael's last year, but I've seen them this year. And you guys probably haven't ever seen my owl collection, but I really like owls a lot. So I have a bunch of them all around the house. And this is some that are just on my little dresser in the kitchen. We store towels and stuff in here. So towels and extra placemats, tablecloths, you know, your big stuff you need in the kitchen. So that's my first set of fall decorations. And I'll show you the others in a second. I also put out a couple of pumpkins. That owl always stays there, but I put out these two little pumpkins. Um, I might move them to the outdoors, but right now I just put them in here. Honestly, I just wanted to have them out. Um, but I might put them on the back porch at some point. I don't know. I haven't decided. The puppies get excited about that kind of stuff though, don't you? So. Yeah, for now they're in the house so we can enjoy them. I'm also thinking about putting out my fall wreath. I feel like it's too hot though. <laughs> I know it's October and it's okay to have it out, but it's like gonna get up to 90 degrees again today. So I feel like it's kind of weird to have a pumpkin wreath out, but I think I might put it out anyway. I'm still trying to decide. This is my current wreath situation. So I think I'm gonna go get the pumpkin one out of the garage if I can get to it without too much trouble. Yay, I switched it out. So now it's more proper for fall time. I don't really love this wreath though as much as I remembered loving it. Um, I had it last year and now I'm looking at it and I'm like, eh, I don't know. It looks more wintery to me. So maybe I might go find something different. This is what happens anytime I walk out the door. I have these poor little pitiful people staring at me. Whoa, Bailey! Thinking I've left. Aren't they so cute in their little outfits? Um, we've actually got these from two different places, like years apart, but they just match so cute. I love them. So Oscar's is actually a rugby shirt and Bella's is like a little sailor dress. Let me see. See rugby shirt? So he is number three on the team. And then what's weird, because PetSmart is a bunch of weirdos. <laughs> Okay, but a three up here, which he doesn't care, but there's a three on there and there's a 63 down there. I think that's funny, but that's a really cute shirt anyway. And then Bella, Bella. Let's see your dress. Show me your dress. See, so see, it has a little dog right there. Let me see, see the front. Whoa, okay. Well, it has buttons on the front too. You guys probably are not going to be allowed to see that. Let me see. We'll see. Yeah, there's buttons in the collar. So it's a collared dress with buttons, and it's super cute. out today I thought I would sit in the house for my lunch break I usually like to be outside but it's like 92 and it's only like 1 30 so we're gonna sit in the house I'm gonna knit and watch some podcast um, so I guess watch me watch other people knit while you watch me knit <laughs> Pie Productions, in case you guys want to know. She's talking about our coffee. Mm -hmm. And she's going to do what I'm doing. <laughs> oh my 
my god. <laughs> so she literally is watching a podcast while she's knitting, and I'm watching her watch a podcast and knit while I knit. That is hilarious. what I'm knitting. So um, a few days ago I cast on for Tecumseh and this is what I have so far. And this is actually the second time I've gotten about this far on it. The first time was with a lighter gray and a different brown. Well it was a brown instead of a peach color. Um, and I had to frog that so I dyed up some darker gray and then this peach color and I cast on again and I like it so far. Look at my floaties! Have you made a Tecumseh? Leave a comment and let me know. Awesome. 